Here with Tony Stewart, third place tonight here at Motor Mile. You had the lead early there and you lost it on a restart to Brad. What what more did you need after that? What happened on that restart? It just got tight. I mean, at the beginning when we were on stickers, uh, I was able to really roll the corner really well. And could run off the bottom a half to three quarters of a car up in the center of the corner and then just turn and come down the hill and get a straight, good forward drive off. And uh, every caution, I just got a little bit tighter, a little bit tighter at the center of the corner. So just couldn't, couldn't rotate like I could early and uh, just got worse as we went. This place put on a pretty good show tonight. I know the point of SRX is to showcase a bunch of different short tracks around the country. Do you think maybe SRX might be seen back here again? I like this track. Uh, I thought it raced really well. It, there were a lot of options. If, your car, if you could get your car to rotate, you could move up the racetrack and then dime in the corner off. Uh, when it got tight, you had to roll right around the bottom. So uh, it, it gave you a lot of options and had an awesome crowd here. Uh, Motor Mile's an awesome facility. The Hagen family do an awesome job here. They build a great place. So uh, it's cool to do this and get to race at my funny car driver's home track. But uh, glad we got on the podium. Was hoping for a little better than that, but we got everything we could get. One more question. The aggression just seems to keep ramping up every year in this series. Tore up a bunch of cars again tonight. What's it going to take to stop tearing up race cars every week? Quit having the guys that are tearing cars up come back. I'm coming back. So, uh, yeah, it's. Uh, I, I haven't seen any of the stuff. L luckily, it was all behind me, but it sounds like it's the same cast of characters. So. This is Austin Dillon, driver of the Bass Pro Shop Chevrolet. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, check out one of those two videos beside me. Visit frontstretch.com for more racing content.